Hi everyone and welcome to another review with Misty Vapor. We're going to talk about some juice from Lazarus Vintage. That's right, they have a new line out. I've been giving it away to people on my show because Lazarus Vintage sponsors the Hot Mess show. And for Christmas, I got this beautiful Lazarus Vintage box mod. It is number 103. It's got the little pedometer. Very nice, clean box. I have absolutely no issues with it. I can run a dripper. I can run a, a sub ohm tank, whatever I want to on this. So my guys over there at Lazarus Vintage, which would be Bruce, Keith, and Sir James. Thank you guys. I love it. It is cranberry in color. You guys go check them out. They're, they're beautiful boxes. All right. Now we're going to review some flavors. First up we'll do is golden. Three milligram. Their juice is, Nor is Max Vici. It didn't want to open. I can already smell what this flavor is. And I have not tasted it. This is first time taste. That's what took me so long to open the bottle. It was still sealed. I've opened two flavors from them. And I love them both. Yummy. All right. This is probably one of the best mango vapes I've tried. It is not harsh by any means. It's nice and fruity. I mean, as soon as I dripped it on my cotton, I could smell that mango. And I'm not that big of a fan of mango, but this mango doesn't taste like most mangoes I've tried. I am really, really impressed with this mango juice. It is the truest taste it doesn't taste like artificial kind of mango it tastes like like I just like bit into a mango fruit it's delicious definitely my mango lovers out there definitely give this a try okay next up we're gonna try some jade Mm, this one, to me, I'm picky with, with peach. It is a peach cobbler. But like I said, I'm kind of picky on my peach flavor. So this is one juice that is not up in my flavor profile. It is a very good juice, very quality made Max VG juice. It's just something about that peach is rubbing me, that rubbing my taste buds the wrong way. Now, like I tell you guys, taste is subjective. Just because I don't like it doesn't mean you're not going to like, not love it. I'm particularly just kind of picky when it comes to certain flavors. Peach and pear are definitely ones that I've really not found, but like one or two and everything I've tried that I've liked. So, 
the peach, it tastes like peach cobbler. It's just I don't like the flavoring of the peach, in my opinion. All right. Next up is Phoenix. Oh, yeah. Now, this one is it's described as like a brandy seared apple. I get a really good crisp apple flavor with like just hints of the brandy. Like you're not getting like a whole lot of like brandy in your face, which is good because not everybody wants that pungent, really strong brandy flavor. But all in all, this is a really good one. It's a nice, smooth kind of really gives you something that you would not expect, I guess is the best way to say it. Like when I was reading through the descriptions earlier, I was like, hmm, let's see, you know, because like I said, you're seeing my first response of these juices. I have not been vaping them because after I open the first two and I really love them and we will get to those, I was like, um, yeah, probably not a good idea to vape them or I'm not going to have them by the time it's time to do the review. I am on exhale getting like a little, a little bit of that cinnamon, like a bakery cinnamon taste. I don't get it so much on inhale, but I do get it on the exhale. So on inhale, I'm getting that, that little bit of brandy flavor with the, with the crisp apples. And on exhale, I'm getting all of that with like a cinnamon, bakery cinnamon kind of flavor. It's not super strong. It is like very it's not super light either. It's just like the perfect amount that follows through with it. It reminds me almost like the spiced cinnamon apples, but like the best ones you've ever had. That's what it reminds me of with a little bit of that brandy. Definitely a good juice. All right, next up we've got Silk. Mm, my plastic is falling off of that one. I like the fruitiness to this, but there's something kind of funny in it to me. This is the perfect martini nightlife capered on a bed of fruit. I'm wondering if it's the martini. I don't think I've ever had a martini. So I'm wondering if that is the flavor in, in, when I first exhaled that I'm tasting that I'm not a fan of. I like that fruitiness that comes through, but I'm not big on that martini kind of type of flavor. It's definitely different.
right. And next up we've got, oh, we already did that. That was silk. Next up we have Blossom. Blossom is slightly toasted truffle surrounded by a wonderful array of juicy berries and cream. Never really had truffles. The juicy berries and you get the cream, you get that. But once again, with this one, that, that truffles, it, it kind of throws me off a little bit. Um, I like the berry flavor. I like the creamy flavor, but that, that, the truffle flavor. The one thing I can say about Lazarus is their juice is like no other. Like you're not going to get this kind of flavor from your average juice juice vendor. Like they they take it to the extreme and in a very well in a very well and positive way. And the last two I have saved, I have dripped quite a bit of. We've got Pearl. Come on, Pearl. There it goes. These are very cute little dripper bottles. Oh, there we go. Focus. Okay, I've never had Chinese Lotus candy before, but this juice makes me want to try it because I really like Pearl. Pearl is just, it is described as a Chinese Lotus candy wrapped in a winter melon. This juice to me is absolutely phenomenal. Like it is, like I said, their juice is like nothing you've ever tried. And this one definitely hits the spot. Like the flavors combined together it is just it's delicious oh my god I don't even want to burn the rest of this off. I just want to sit here and vape and vape and vape this flavor. And last but not least, we have Imperial. Imperial. Why is it the ones I've already opened? I'm going to be stubborn with me. When... The two I have recommended on the show have been in Pearl and the and the Pearl because those are the only two I had opened. And I opened them because somebody that won was like, what do they taste like? So instead of just giving them the description, I actually opened the bottles and tasted them. This is another one that's my favorite. Between those two, I can't pick which one I like the best. Imperial is <coughs> a milky dose glaze with a dash of lemon cream. Their lemon cream, they've nailed it. It does not have that super strong lemon flavor. It is a really nice light lemon. And then the lemon with that creaminess, almost like um, if you were to take like a fresh cream that you've made almost like a whipping cream or something and then added lemon to it and mix that together that is what you get 
with that that dose that glaze kind of that dose glaze kind of flavor very very well made juice all of them are a very well made juice there are flavors in there and you'll see in this review that you know that I may not agree with that are not in my flavor profile but just know that even though I don't like them you may love them so definitely I would totally recommend Lazarus Vintage I've always recommended Lazarus and you guys once again thank you for the box I really love it she's beautiful <coughs> and that concludes this review down in the description area you will find the links for Lazarus Vintage Facebook page as well as their website their website is gorgeous I love just going and looking around to see what other graphics they've come up with and stuff as, as well as their Facebook page and they are celebrating I will tell you right now anniversary celebration they've got a buy two get one free going on right now so you guys definitely go check that out and then let them know that Misty Vapor sent you and that concludes this review I'm Misty Vapor saying vape on and vape strong. <laughs>